Hey everybody, it's Eileen from basicblogtips.com. Coming up, today we'll talk about Twitter. Have you ever thought about running an ad on Twitter? Well, the Twitter ad interface is very simple and I'm just gonna walk you through how it works. First, you're gonna choose your location. Now, I picked several countries and this is the way that I decided which countries I wanted to target in my ad. I used a site called Tweets Map. You guys may have used this site before, but what I did was I went in, verified my Twitter account, and then I clicked on the widgets button. I really don't want the widget. I just wanted to see where my followers are coming from. So what you do is hover over these areas. See there's 8.2 coming from the UK and 7.8 coming from India. And then there's Canada. This one is gonna be other. So all of the other smaller countries will be lumped together. Here's Australia, Philippines, France. So you can use that as a guide to decide what locations you want your ad to show up. Then you would just simply pick how much money you want to spend per day, how much your bid is going to be for each new follower. But you don't have to use this to promote your account. You can also use it to promote specific tweets. So if you have an, a campaign going, perhaps you have a blog post where you're trying to uh, promote uh, an affiliate product or you have an event coming up, this would be an excellent time to use Twitter's promoted tweets. And what you get a chance to do is once again, set the rate per day and the amount for each click It'll tell you how many you can expect during any given day. And this will scroll through your recent tweets. And this is how you go in and decide which tweets you're going to promote. If you've recently tweeted something that you're not interested in promoting, you would just say, never promote this tweet. And it'll pick up the next one. Now, what I would suggest, especially if you're promoting an event, just tailor your tweet with five different messages about the event and then load those up in Twitter and they will be your last five here you can scroll through. Then you would just enter your payment information. And I think what the most important thing is here to make sure you set your spending limit within something that's affordable for you. I do like the fact that Twitter gives you your following rate and your click through rate tells you exactly how many people followed you and how many clicks and impressions you received on your ad. I want to share with you some success I received as a result of my Twitter ad. I uploaded some slides to SlideShare, which I just started using this week. And already I got an email from SlideShare telling me that it was being retweeted more than anything else on SlideShare and they put it on the home page. And just to give you a little bit more, in just two days, this SlideShare was viewed over a thousand times. Now the Twitter ad wasn't the only thing that I used to promote this, but I didn't put it up on Facebook or anything else. I used just retweet and I used Twitter and I just tweeted it out myself. And uh, I have so many followers on SlideShare and because of the nature of the slides, I was able to get over a thousand views within two days, which is really, I thought, impressive considering I just started using it a couple of days ago. Okay. 
Well, this has been your walkthrough for Twitter ads. Once again, it's Eileen from basicblogtips.com. You can follow me on Twitter at basicblogtips. One last thing, while you're on YouTube, come up to the subscribe button right here and subscribe to my channel and make sure you get the email updates so you don't miss a thing. Hey, have yourself an awesome day and I'll see you next time on the Miss Eileen Speaks YouTube channel. Peace.